Hi, 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 everybody. It's Alache. I am so excited. I'm back. I am back. Now, as to why I left, I wish I could tell you, but let's just say I had to take a break for a little bit, but I'm back and I'm so excited to be back on my channel. Thank you to everybody who filled in for me. I hope you guys enjoyed my family. They did an awesome job. Good job. Good job. Really good job. They cracked some jokes. They told you guys maybe a little bit too much, but um, I'm happy to be back. So this week, I wanted to do a DIY. I guess you guys are probably tired of people talking your ear off, or maybe not, but I figured we'd bring back some activity to the channel. It's the springtime rolling in, so I'm gonna show you guys a quick, simple, inexpensive way to get your front door or your front porch at least just a little bit inviting in the season and um, that's what we're gonna be doing today so um, let's get the show rolling all right you guys so just to get oh by the way we're outside and I literally live like on the road <laughs> so excuse the cars but um, I just wanted to walk you guys through what I did everything I bought today was at the dollar store as usual you guys know I'm a dollar store junkie anyways I except for the planter Except for the stamps that I'm putting the, the little planters in that I got from Home Depot. They were like 15, 16 bucks thereabouts. So basically what I did was I wanted to have like the cactus, like the greens, the moss kind of going on with this. And then because this is sitting on the floor, I wanted like the grass, the illusion of like butterflies. Because my daughters, you know, they like like that whole fantasy fairy tale type situation. So I always try to work them into my decor somehow, keeping it classy. So I had that, so that kind of bounces off on that end. And then here I just put in like some neutrals, you know, like cream colors and a little bit of white blooms just kind of sprouting out. And then just, you know, the hint of lavender here and, and light yellow. And the moss was like a dollar for the bag. And I just used that to just kind of accent that piece up. And this cute little things, which I plan on getting some more, the LED like little lamp. So I plan on getting some more of that. But you guys can see how you can literally just utilize like a little space and just make it pretty. Like if you saw the before and the after, it's like night and day. And I love this little mat here that I got. So when you're walking into my house, it says hello. And when you're leaving, it's goodbye. <laughs> But so, um, I'm just super excited and just excited about this season and I'm going to be showing you guys more tips on how I plan on just bringing seasons into my home. Just little changes. You'll see how I'll change this out like in the summertime or the winter or whatever or in the fall. You guys will see. So another tip I have for you guys, I didn't have time to get that done today, but this wall here, I feel like there needs to be something happening here. So I plan on getting like some cocoa liners and just put it in the planter and just hanging that out. So I'm not gonna show you guys that today, obviously, because it's not done. But in another video, I'll make sure that I kind of show you guys like the finished product. And maybe it'll be done before this video comes out and I'll put a picture up so you guys can see what that looks like. I hope you guys enjoyed everything today and I will see you back next week.